to Equinox right now for a true bar class. My room is so messy, it's actually overwhelming me, but I just have so many exams coming up that it's like I can't even think about the mess around me until I get past what I need to get past. I'm not wearing makeup to the gym because I'm just gonna end up showering anyways. My outfit is pretty simple, y'all saw me. I'm wearing this unitard and a scuba on top. So I wouldn't feel naked, but when class starts, this is coming off. I'm on my way to the gym right now. Ignore those clothes. I, I've been keeping like an extra work outfit in my car just in case I decide I feel like going to the gym. I really want to get in the sauna today. I've never been in the sauna. Actually, I have been in the sauna before, but not at my gym. And it always looks so cute. Like the girlies, they just like strip down and get in there. And I'm like, I want to try that. Also, I'm trying to get my lash extensions off. So I feel like the steam will help with that. Hey y'all, so I'm done working out. It was so, so hard. My whole body's on fire. I sat in the sauna and it was honestly so relaxing. It was just a good time, like sitting there. Yeah, I just put on a little simple outfit, just a little Skims dress and some sneakers. I bought this silver metallic shirt off of Skims. I wanted it in the short sleeve, but they were sold out. So I bought the long sleeve one, the turtleneck one. I don't like it. Well, it's actually cute, but I just don't see myself wearing it for real. So I'm about to take it to my tailor and have him turn it into like a regular crew neck t-shirt. And I also need to get some of these cargo pants taken in. Aren't these so cute? I got them from Zara, regular $70. Got them for nine. I need that waist taken in real bad. It's a lot. It's like so much. Eating my first meal of the day and watching Clark on live. I literally love Clark. Right now I'm just making some more noodles for this chicken parmesan from like from the other night. Eight days later. Some things have changed, okay? I got my hair rebraided, way less heavy than those other braids. I just look all around better because it's my birthday. Well, actually my birthday was two days ago, but all the festivities are getting started now because I was still in school and now it's a Saturday and I can like actually enjoy my life. I did do a little bit of shopping. I went to David Yearman because I'm obsessed with David Yearman, you guys. That's the only place I buy my jewelry from. Um, like I just love everything about it. It's so freaking cute. And my mom got me a new bracelet for my birthday and all my friends got me gift cards to there. So I was like, you know what? Let me get a ring real quick. It's been such a busy day. I didn't film all of it. I got my day started, had to film an ad, and I've actually had like a stomach bug. Like on my birthday, I had a stomach bug, which is gross. My friend came with me to help me get these clips, and then I got to go to the mall. But right now, I'm headed home so that I can just shower and get ready for the night. Let us unbox what I got. The woman who helped him was so sweet and she was like, since it's your birthday, like I'm gonna make the best bow. I really do think this is the best bow I've ever gotten from there. I really do just live for presentation. This is everything for me. Literally gorgeous. This is the infinity band. I think that's what it's called. And I got it in a size seven. 
so freaking cute. Boy, I literally have no clue what I'm gonna wear tonight for me. But y'all, I just got this salt hair body oil in the mail yesterday and it is so good. I can see why this is always sold out. I had it on today and it doesn't give me like that greasy, nasty, like slick oil feeling. It just makes my skin look super radiant, super glowy, like that oiled up look, but without that like nasty, slimy feel. I was a little bit nervous because I don't like Santal anything because I think it smells like pickles, but this doesn't really smell like anything. It's just very musky. And I like that it doesn't smell like anything because I can pair it with all my perfumes. For my actual birthday though, I didn't vlog. I was just living in the moment. My boyfriend bought me some skims, which is so sweet of him. I was showing how my mom got me a new bracelet from David Dearman. A few of my friends got me some gift cards. And I ended up getting this ring today. And then my boyfriend bought me the new skims drop. I'm wearing it right now because he knows how much I love skims. And then he also got me the new New Valentino Born in Roma Intense. If y'all want me to let y'all know what I think about this one versus the original, which I love so much, let me know. I tried this when it first came out and I really, really liked it, but I never actually bought it because it's something about buying perfume. I always end up feeling like guilty. I don't know. I, I typically do end up buying it, but this one, I don't know. I just didn't buy it so he bought it for me right now i'm just going to hop in the shower real quick to freshen up shave because my arms are so hairy right now it's actually sick and i'll come back and do my makeup okay, i'm hopping out of the shower my face is a little bit red because i did like a facial remover cream i use that to just take off my little peach fuzz and then shake my eyebrows i'm obsessed with my foreo bear this is so cute i just got this pink one and you're gonna see how my face twitches that lets me know it's working oh my god but yeah i have tried the new face and i honestly did not like it i hated it actually it oh, oh it shocked my face so much way too long to see anything like this one works in two minutes the only reason my face is doing that is because i have it on the highest setting of my pro current right now i'm watching the game on netflix i'm obsessed with the game i've watched it maybe like four times over i cannot get over how durin got janae pregnant and then melanie had to just like deal with it oh my god my face looks so messed up right now <laughs> yeah, I love these braids y'all. I just asked for small knotless and I go to like an African braid shop is the girls in Houston charge like $600 $1,000 for knotless braids like why are y'all even asking me for that? You know, they're not worth $1,000. You know that it's got this Ola Henriksen banana bright vitamin CC stick in the mail And it's just like a little color corrector. Clearly I have very dark under eyes So I'm just trying to See what this is about look better already like that's literally all it is for foundation this is my favorite it's the mac studio radiance face and body sheer and it's just like a little sheer skin tint sort of vibe concealer i'm using two this is the rare beauty for my face and under my eyes i use like a neutral this is the Too faced concealer and I've been using this random little Charlotte Tilbury sample. All my concealer like sets and everything, I'm gonna use the Fenty Matchstick in the shade Trouble to just sort of like contour. I think I'm gonna keep it fun and wear the Lucky Blush from Rare Beauty. I have these two Makeup by Mario palettes, the ones that like broke TikTok. I look at them and I'm like, what do I even do? I just use the same brown every single time, but uh, I need to do something. Like, it's my birthday, like my sweet 22. I'm just gonna swirl a random, or just multiple random browns on my eye. I'm gonna use my finger on one of these shimmery shades in the Ethereal Eyes palette. Yeah, I'm not like totally into it, but it's something, it's definitely on there. I'm gonna try a new mascara. This is the YSL Lash Clash. I don't know if it actually is new, but it's new to me. I just got it in the mail, cause YSL has been mailing your girl, like. Okay, purr, this is, oh yeah, mm-hmm. Oh yeah, this is cute. This is really good. I like that it clicks shut. Like, 
yeah so you know it's actually closed and your mascara isn't drying out i always over blush so i'm gonna use a little more i'm gonna use the nars exposed palette this came out in 2019 like it's so good i refuse to throw this out i don't care if mold starts to develop so i kind of just swirl all the ones over here especially this brown one the highlighter i'm using the westman atelier nectar like highlighting balm and this just gives my skin like such a pretty dewy look like oh yeah i don't know what to do with the lips i'm gonna go no lip i do need to figure out what i'm gonna wear though so let me like go to the drawing board so this is what i've decided on for the outfit i'm wearing the zara like viral zip up top with these leather pants i think i'm gonna go no necklace Maybe, possibly. I was thinking Love by Killian, but I'm actually gonna wear Bond Number no. 9 at Greenwich Village. This smells too good. And I'm, right now I have on the Fenty Vanilla Dream Body Butter. So my skin looks all like yummy and shiny and good. So I decided on the lip. I'm wearing the NYX Espresso Liner with the Merit Beauty Baby Lipstick and then the Dior Gold Shimmering Gloss. And I, I don't really like my outfit too much. But I have to go, like, I can't keep going back and forth about it. Look at how perfect I literally just pulled up. Y'all, I got into a car accident on my way here, lol. And the woman was like, what perfume are you wearing? Like, I stepped out of the car and she was like, what perfume are you wearing? It smelled so good. And the officer was like, yeah, I was thinking that too. And I literally have to give them my perfume. So if that's not reason enough to buy this, are we going? Dang, it's had it very well. You never get oh it. Uh, it is Thanksgiving. Hey guys, I am back home from my dinner. I've like washed my face and everything. And I had such a great time. I just love my friends so much. I'm already dressed for bed, ready to go. I'm wearing my Halloween pajamas. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see y'all next time. Bye.